Hi guys, it's Janet. Welcome back to my channel. Today what I'm sharing with you is a huge Halloween decor haul. I am so excited about Halloween this year. For the past couple of years, I kind of skipped over Halloween decor. I just went straight into fall and kind of left that up until um, it was time to decorate my tree. In Texas, it's like really super hot and um, I just kind of leave like the summer decorations out for a really long time and then I jump right into fall as soon as I can. But I don't want to skip Halloween this year. I'm super excited. The theme that I'm doing is Halloween glam. My color schemes for my house are white and gold, so I want to add in the Halloween and make it white, gold, and black. So I've been purchasing a bunch of stuff that I want to share with you. I will definitely film like how I place all the items um, probably in a later video. I like to do my hauls by stores so I stay organized, but I have been piling up the decor for a couple of weeks now and I'm ready to share it with you guys. The first store that I'm going to share with you, I can't really link stuff because uh, it's home goods and I don't shop online at home goods. I just go into the store and buy stuff. Um, and they don't have like a bunch of stuff. So I recommend if you find something at home goods, get it. Cause when you go back, it's not going to be there. And that happened to me with the first thing I'm going to share with you. I bought these plates and I totally love them. I think they're super cute, but honestly I had seen some other plates, um, that I wanted. Um, but I bought a bunch of other stuff and I was like, no, I didn't know if I was going to use plates or what I was going to do. So I said, I will come back for them. And when I went back, they weren't there. So I, of course, did go back and I found these plates and I think they're just as cute. So I plan on setting my table for like a Halloween um, dinner or when we eat dinner, we can just use these plates. But I just thought they were super cute. I love like a day of the dead and sugar skulls. So I thought they were super cute. These were only $16.99 and I bought eight of them. So I have kind of like a theme that I want to decorate and I'll share it with you guys like on a later video like how I do my Halloween tablescape. Oh, there's Rocky. <laughs> Hi, Boo Boo Bear. The next thing is just this little bowl and the plates that I told you that I did not buy kind of go with this bowl um, a little more but so I might return this bowl because I don't know or just use it like as a candy dish but this was only $3.99 and I think it's like super cute. Okay, so the next item is this like candy dish um, and this was $12.99 and it's just like a black candy dish with skulls holding it up so I think it's super cute as well. The next item is this little gold jack-o-lantern and I might actually um, spray paint this one rose gold because in my kitchen I have rose gold and marble and I need like a jack-o-lantern that is uh, rose gold and I don't have one so I thought this one would be perfect. It's just like a little small size. Okay, the next couple of items, I am not sure about one of them. Sean hates it, my husband, but I think it's really cute so we'll see what happens. But it's this guy and it's just like a little skeleton man with a super cute outfit on and this was $24.99. I didn't know it was that much, but um, I think it's so cute and kind of goes with my theme of like glam Halloween. Rocky's in my background. <laughs> the next item is this Day of the Dead, like a little statue. I completely love Day of the Dead. I I don't know, I just have a lot of Day of the Dead stuff because I really love it. I love uh, using it when it's single the mile, so I feel like it's multi-purpose. Like I can use it during Halloween, but then I can also use it um, in Cinco de Mayo or if I have like a um, Mexican party. But yeah, this one is super cute. So this is Sean and of course this is me. And this little statue was only $14.99. And I the next item I completely fell in love with. It is such a statement piece. Um, I don't know if I'm going to use it like on my buffet table, my entry doorway. I don't know, but I just love it so much. And it is this guy. So I just love skeletons. I think for some reason this year I'm crazy about skeletons. Um, it's super big and it's pretty heavy. And I just think like the quality of it is super good. So it's got like a black top hat with kind of like gold on it and the buttons are really cute. This was, I don't remember how much this was. This was $34.99. Um, I did actually see one that's very similar 
at Lowe's. If you go to Lowe's, they have really, and I bought some stuff from Lowe's, so I'll share it with you guys, but they have like a smaller version of this. Um, I don't know how much it was, but I just like this like big grand piece. I put him back there because I think he's so cute. Um, the next thing that I have to share is this um, skull that's decorated really super cute with like rhinestones around the head. And this one is kind of more like a silver decor, but in my entryway, I do have a little bit of silver there, so I think it'll look perfect there. This one was $14.99, and it also lights up. I think I already put batteries in it, so let me check, yeah. Oh yeah, so see how the little skull lights up, like almost like a little flashlight, um, and it's super cute. The next item is this gold little skull, and it also lights up too. I haven't put batteries in this one, but it's just gold, and I think it'll look really pretty on my shelves that are in my um, living room or maybe on my coffee table, but it's a little smaller than the white one that I just showed you, um, but yeah. This one was also $14.99, so they were both the same price. Okay, the next couple of things are from uh, TJ Maxx, which is very similar to Home Goods. I think like TJ Maxx, Home Goods, and Marshalls are kind of like the same family of stores, so you can find some of the same things at all three stores, but I just popped in there because I was looking for those plates that I didn't see at Home Goods. I was like, maybe they have them at TJ Maxx but they didn't. Um, but I did find this really cute pumpkin. Well, it's just a white pumpkin with black little lettering that says trick or treat. And of course, I had to get a coffee mug for um, Halloween time. And I just thought this one was adorable. Um, it says witch's brew on it. And I got this at TJ Maxx as well. This one was $4.99 and I will be using it all of October to drink my coffee. Okay, the next store I'm gonna share is Lowe's they have a lot of really cute stuff. I totally recommend going in there. There's a couple things I have my eye on. I'm not sure if I'm gonna get, but I definitely got a couple things I'm gonna share, and I think they're so cute. I'm gonna tell you what I wanna do with them. So I bought these little um, skeletons there at Lowe's, and I think this was like $5. They also have something similar, similar to this at Michael's, um, but it's for like a DIY project that I'm gonna do. We're having a Halloween costume contest, and what I wanna do is make some little um, trophy, so when we announce the winner, there's like an actual trophy that goes with it. So I saw, on Pinterest, I saw this idea and I thought it was so adorable, but I bought these little like, um, platforms at Michael's and then I'm gonna glue this guy on there and then I need to get like a little trophy <laughs> Hi Rocky and um, I'm gonna spray paint it all gold and then I'll be able to hand these out as like little trophies Okay, do you guys see this? <laughs> Hi baby, come here. Oh, do you guys remember my baby Rocky? Fish. Come here, sit in my lap Okay Sorry about the that. The next item is really big. I hope it's like folded up right now, but I have plans for it as well. Okay, so this is it. It's like a five foot skeleton. Cute. And for the price, it's amazing. I have seen skeletons running from like all different price ranges, but this one was the least expensive. It was $35 uh, at Lowe's and I have, I have my eye on one at another store online, which is like, so gorgeous but expensive and I don't want to pay that much money so I'm gonna actually spray paint this one gold so I'm probably gonna glue his like little mouth shut and then I'll insert a picture of what I'm talking about I want it to look like so I'm hoping that it works but I'm gonna buy him like a little top hat and paint him gold and like um, either have him sit at my dining room table or somewhere in my house. I don't know where, I haven't decided, but when I do the tour, you guys will see where I put him. But the next store I'm gonna share is a store called At Home. And I definitely wanna get some more stuff from there, but I have to kind of start laying this stuff out because I bought so much stuff already and seeing like what's gonna work, what's not gonna work, and then go pick up like the rest of the stuff that I'm missing. Hello, I'm sharing another skeleton and I will tell you why. I'm gonna insert the picture of why I want this skeleton. Sean and I are hosting a Halloween party for our friends, and of course we always go all out when we do the decorating, so um, that is why the skeleton is for, and it's for this like little um, 
drink area that we're gonna have that basically says um, pick your poison. So this is the skeleton and it was only $14.99. So I think it's a really good price. I probably won't paint this one gold. I thought maybe I would paint him gold, but I'm not. Um, if I don't use him for that project, I'll put him outside because I'm also gonna decorate like my front um, front porch area like Halloween. The next two things are really um, easy breezy. So I just bought these like gold smaller skulls to put probably on my dining room table um, for decor or I don't know, just somewhere. I'm not sure where I'm gonna use them. And if I don't use them, I'm definitely gonna return them, but um, we'll see. And then last from at home, is this um, table runner. So I'll use this for the party or maybe my tablescape, but it's just this like black lacy table runner. And this was only $6. Moving on to Michael's, I was going to Michael's almost every other day because I was taking advantage of their like coupon. So if you guys don't know, but they have like a 40 or 50% off coupon um, and you can buy something, but it has to be regular price. So um, the Halloween decor wasn't on sale at all, so it's like just buying one thing at a time or making Sean go with me and buy stuff. But I bought a lot of stuff to share and there's a couple more things that I might want as well. We'll see. The first item is this pumpkin and I just think it's like super cute. It's my theme, white with black. It's just a bunch of hocus pocus. I don't know where I'll use this, but I really like it. Uh, the next item is actually the first piece of Halloween decor I bought. I was in Michael's, I don't even know what I was doing there, but I bought this like two weeks ago or longer. It's been a while, but it's this like jack, staffed jack-o'-lanterns. I love the color so much because it's just like so neutral like my house, but it's just gonna give me that like pop of Halloween decor that I'm looking for. So I could use this anywhere and I just love it so much. I could see myself using this for years and years. Okay, the next couple of items are lanterns. I love to use lighting for decorating. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna use these outside. I'm, I think I'm gonna use these outside. That's what I'm planning on. We'll see what happens when I'm actually decorating, but um, I got these two, so they're both from Michaels, and they have little, I always put the receipts with the stuff so I don't lose them, because I hate it when I lose a receipt, but these are it, and they're just two different sizes, so I'll put them next to each other, um, probably outside. Then I have this um, stack of like books, like fake looking books, and they're just super cute black with like, kind of like a coppery rose gold um, decoration. The last thing from Michaels, I think this is the last thing. Cause, oh no, it's not. I saw a couple more things. So it's this like candlestick and I was thinking of getting two, which I might do. I have this old pumpkin from last year's Target and I was thinking of just like maybe that, I don't know. Last couple of things from Michaels are for a wreath I'm planning to make. Uh, I'll probably film a tutorial if I make a wreath. I always make my own wreaths usually. And I got a couple of things, but I'm not set on like what I wanna do yet. But I thought they had a lot of cute little wreath stuff this year, so I thought I'd share it with you guys. Um, and it's basically just like these little picks, so I love these like black and white little pumpkins. And then this is like a witch's hat. And then I got two of these little like witch boot or whatever. I don't know why I lost, like I couldn't think of what it was. Um, oh, here's the other one. And um, also just like this little cat. So I haven't decided the Halloween um, wreath yet, but I'm definitely working on it and I wanna film a video to share with you guys because I love making wreaths. That is all for Michaels. My video is getting super long, you guys, I'm sorry. Um, the last thing I wanna share is an amazing store that I found. Um, actually watching YouTube videos, I was just watching like Halloween decor videos already and I found this store called um, is it Gandon Road? I'll put the name of the store on the screen and I'll link this below because I bought it online. But it is this super cute rat that um, is a skeleton, of course. And Sean and I want to use this for our Halloween party and I'll show you like the Pinterest picture that we picked it out from. But it's going to be so cute. It's like basically this, this rat eating like cheese. Um, and the quality of this is amazing. So... It really is super cute. And it was, I think I paid $8 for it, so, and they have free shipping. 
Okay, that is everything that I have to share with you. I know it's a lot. Sorry if the video got really long. I hope you guys took stuck around with me and are looking forward to a lot more Halloween videos because I am going to go crazy decorating. Thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye!